So my handy temperature sensor also measures oxygen. So let's see what the dissolved oxygen concentrations are like in this lake. Well, I already took a measurement at the surface, and it was about 95% saturated. And I lowered the temperature sensor to 10 meters, because we can assume the epilimian is pretty well mixed. And at 10 meters, there's 76% oxygen. Let's go lower. So I've lowered to 13 meters. Let's see what it's like. Oxygen in readings always take a little bit longer to stabilize than temperature readings, so it's good to make sure that your instrument has stabilized on a number. At 13 meters, we're at 52% oxygen. Let's go down to 15 meters. Not a bad day to wait out on a lake looking at oxygen readings. So at 15 meters, we have about 43% oxygen. Let's go down to 17 meters. So at 17 meters, the temperature is 9.3 degrees Celsius. So we're well into the hypolimian. So at 17 meters, we have about 34% oxygen. Let's go down to 20 meters. At 20 meters, the temperature is 8.2 degrees Celsius. And as we know, oxygen in cold water should be higher at saturation. So at 20 meters depth, the oxygen percentage is 37%. So we still have oxygen in the hypolimian, although it's getting pretty low. And it won't be until fall turnover that this lake gets oxygen replenished down to the hypolimian. 